The truth is, they will pretend to love you. They will pretend to be there for you. They will pretend to do everything for you. But if your eyes are wide open, you will know. Because the Nigerian man cannot bring Keeping up on last week's discussion, where I told you guys that I'll be spilling a lot of Nigerian men secrets. Now, someone chatted me, telling me, because of course I have to spill the secrets with a story behind. Now, someone chatted me, telling me that, see, she's in love with this Nigerian man. The Nigerian man loves her so much and she loves this Nigerian man so much. But the thing is, he's sometimes very, you know, like rough with her, the way he treats her, that he's not so considerate, telling her bad words and abusing her. And sometimes when he requests for something and he's not able to get it, the way he treats her, he treats her like shit. And she starts to wonder if this is the same person who said he loves her. Now, which brings me to treatment and Nigerian men. Now, if you'd like to know more about how Nigerian men treat women, they love you, they do not love you, they are real with you, they are not real with you. If this is something you would like to hear more about, hang on, okay? Okay guys, so welcome back. So as I was saying, how do you know that a Nigerian man actually, actually, truly cares for you? How do you know that he's not just telling you all those things just to make you feel like he really loves you? Will a Nigerian man, just because you did something wrong, go all around and start to insult you and be abusive towards you? Now, that is certainly unlikely, and I'm going to tell you why. Now, Nigerian men are this kind of being that when they love someone, when a Nigerian man truly, truly loves you, let me tell you how we say it in Pidgin. And when I mean a new Mumu is born, it means when a Nigerian man loves you, he becomes a fool for you. He lets go a lot of things that ordinarily he would have talked about. He lets go a lot of things that ordinarily he wouldn't have let a woman do to him. But just because he's in love with you, you would do those things and go, go freely with it or get away with it. And he would only probably talk to you about it and tell you he doesn't like it. Let me tell you something about women. They are very expressive. A Nigerian man knows how to tell you what he wants to tell you. Because if for nothing, we're just as people that we do not know how to keep our feelings. We do not know how to hide our feelings. So when it comes to that time, they know how to tell you, babe, babe, you messed up. Babe, this thing you did, I don't like it. Please do not do this thing next time. It's, this is not good. You understand? Like, they can share with you. They can tell you. They are not those people who, like, when you do something, they just, you know, bang the door and walk out of you and walk out of your life just because you did something later. <laughs> That's not how Nigerian men love. Nigerian men love and they love. And now, in the opposite direction, if a Nigerian man doesn't love you if a nigerian man is just there to use you now listen up my ladies listen up you may be asking oh why would they use me what would they profit him a nigerian man use women for lots of things and it's not just nigerian men i would hate to say nigerian men do this men all over the world do this so please spare my Nigerian men. I'm just sharing this with you because I'm a Nigerian woman focusing on Nigerian men. So that's why I'm talking about Nigerian men. Because if we have to go global, it's a global phenomenon, okay? So, talking about Nigerian men, if a Nigerian man is just using you, you will know because of his attitude, his actions, his words, everything will be screaming, I am using you. It's just that women do not open their eyes to see. Honestly, my ladies, I am telling you, if a Nigerian man is out to use you, no matter how much he hides, no matter how much he pretends, it is still obvious because he cannot give you that, uh, what do I call it? He cannot give you that, uh, that commitment, that patience, that love that he gives to someone he really loves and cares about. 
He's using you for something and his target is only focused on that thing or that which he's using you for. So now the question is, so what would they be using me for? A lot, a lot. Men use women, men all over the world use women for lots of things. For example, let me give you four things that I know men to use women for. One, he's just using you to catch crews. That's how I would say it in Nigeria. He's just using you to calm himself. He's just using you sexually. He's just using you to take a trip to your Jerusalem all the time. <laughs> that is one. Two, he's using you financially for your money. You got dough, baby. He wants some money because he doesn't have. He wants you for your money. Mommy. He's using you just for papers. Yes, this is something. He's using you for papers. That is, if he's over there already, doesn't have papers, he's trying to use you so he can get papers and have a stay wherever it is. he is. Then four, he may be using you just for visa. Yes, he wants to get out of the country and he needs you to take him over there. So these are various ways in which an Nigerian man can use you. Not just Nigerian men, remember, in which any man can use you. If he's using you for any of these particular reasons, there is no way you expect him to treat you as he's going to treat someone he loves. The truth is, they will pretend to love you. They will pretend to be there for you. They will pretend to do everything for you. But if your eyes are wide open, you will know. Because an Nigerian man cannot pretend so much. Like, you will see it in him. You, you will see it in the way that he's acting. Because everything he's doing will be only for calm. It will just be... He's, he's not acting what he's saying. You understand? And you will see the way that he treats you. There will always be that gap. It doesn't matter how he tries to, to pretend. There will always be that gap in between. He may be telling you something meaning something else. He may be telling you how much he misses you but not calling you. And when you call him, he's not there because he's doing something else. And when he comes, he covers like there is a lot to think about. So that's just what I want to tell you. I'm telling you, when an Nigerian man actually loves you, he's not going to abuse you. A Nigerian man doesn't abuse a woman he loves. A Nigerian man doesn't make a woman he loves suffer. He may fall short of different other things, but he's not gonna abuse you. When I mean abuse you, I mean abuse you. I say both verbally, physically. It's not even a Nigerian man thing to abuse a woman. Okay, okay, let me correct myself. Let me rephrase it. Now, there are some of those men who actually know how to abuse modern women in Nigeria. But there are a few percentage of them. So it's not actually an Nigerian thing to abuse, especially physically, you understand, especially physically or verbally. But they know how to tell you exactly what they want. So, my ladies, if you still want to know more, drop them in the comment section. Tell me what you want to know. What do you want to know about your Nigerian man? Remember that I still offer that one-on-one -on -one and we can talk about your Nigerian man. Of course, you know I charge. It's one of my perks on YouTube, so I do charge for this. So just have it in mind, just in case you were wondering, anything, just anything concerning Nigerian men, our cultures, our traditions, you know, any of all those things you've been confusing yourselves about, do not forget to reach out to me. Like I said, I'm on holiday. This is your time, baby. This is your time, but believe me, when I start working, it's a bit hard, and my friends know, but I still try to make time, but it won't be as it is right now. So, just in case you're wondering, yes, I bought a new camera. I said that before in the formal video. This is my new camera, and I hope it looks good. So, without further ado, do have a lovely day, do have a blessed day, stay happy, stay blessed, and bye-bye.